Yo, ha ha, Bill uh, Nicholson. Uh, what is good, YouTube? Your boy Mill never said coming back with another quick video, man. Today, I mean, I guess you could call today Yeezy Day because should this be the last true batch of Yeezys with Yeezy branding on it? I'm gonna be sad. Let me say now. I, I'll be honest. I came into today's event and thinking that because it's exclusively on confirmed app, and anybody that knows or been rocking with the channel know I have terrible and I mean terrible luck with the confirmed app because I couldn't tell you. I want to say at least four years. In four years, I won one slide on the confirmed app. Four years. So sneakers app. Listen, that was just hit 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 by luck so when the confirmed app came out you saw an array of shoes that were going to drop and how they did it was kind of different and i'm not sure if it was exclusive access per se because they did have it labeled in terms of certain releases you saw exclusive access but i mean a lot of people kind of saw the same shoes for the most part we're talking foam runners slides 350s um and if i'm not mistaken there was a 450 in there somewhere. I think it was labeled Stone Teal, if I'm not mistaken. And by the way, I was thinking about getting that until I realized that I still have my 450 senders. So to me, it didn't make a lick of sense to sit there and get a, a different shade of gray. And I got the dark slate as well. So that didn't make sense. So I looked at the, the lineup and my focus was on originally was on the 500 low utility black now for people that don't know the 500 low it's it's a hit and miss with a lot of people some people like the style but some people don't like the style but it's it's definitely definitely comfortable for long periods of walk i walk my dog in the 500s that i have somewhere around here but um that was one of the things that i was eyeing another thing i was eyeing uh was the yeezy 350 onyx you know although i have <laughs> And if I'm not mistaken, I already have the 350 breads. So to me, that was like mm, hit and miss if I wanted to get that as well, because I have a lot of Yeezy 350s that are predominantly black. So and looking at what I had, it was just like, this is, is it worth getting? Yes, this, this could be the, the last batch of Yeezys. Is it worth getting? Now, when it came to the foam runners, um, I think the one that I was looking at was the MX Senders. And these shoes right here, unless you actually put on a foam runner, there's no better feeling, especially if you go to the beach, um, you know, you're, you're walking around in the water. This is a perfect shoe because of the foam and it's able to wash so easily. So if, even if it dirt, dirties up or if you get scuff marks, you can throw that thing under the sink, put some soap on it, do a little, some brush strokes and, you know, you're pretty much good to go. Uh, so depending on the type of foam color that you get, especially in the foam runner series, um, you, you'll be able to see the marks or you may not be able to see the marks. In this case, and looking at the MX Senders, it's, it's a darker tone um, and a, like a mixture. But the chances of you seeing a mark on that before you see something like these, I think these are the Sands, if I'm not mistaken, um, it's slim. It's very slim. So that was another shoe I was looking at. Another shoe I was looking at was the Yeezy Slide Onyx. And the reason why, because it's black, it's simple, goes with anything. My son has one. I couldn't get one initially when it uh, first came out. So that was frustrating. Um, and then the Yeezy Slide Azure, which is like the all blue Yeezy Slide that I don't think really released exclusively yet like to the public. But if it did, not too many people actually had it. Now, that blue is supposed to be the same color as the Yeezy round jacket, at least the blue one that I got. Um, so, you know, I was curious to see, you know, is it possible for me to get any of them? At least just let me get one. So the Pirate Blacks are slated to release, I'm guessing, the next hour or so. It's like around 7 o'clock here uh, Eastern. And I'm thinking to myself, like, there's no way I'm getting any of these. Oh, man. Comment below. Let me know how you guys did on the confirmed app, the Yeezy releases today, because it was a combination of cues, draws, and the draws. 
some of the draws, you, you the shoes, you would find out that on a later date, possibly a month, that those shoes will ship out because and and that, that kind of makes sense because there's a lot of shoes that they're selling all at one at least at one time and there's a couple of draws where you're not going to see at least in the U.S. you're not going to see who finds out or who wins in I think it's June first second or something like that then you'll find out who who's the actual winner so and going through this I see a notification but not through the Adidas app it's not just yet it was through my email through one of my banks I'm looking. I see a charge, and I'm thinking, oh, okay. Wonder which one hit. To my surprise, the Yeezy Slide Azure. <laughs> Size 13. Now, you know me. I don't celebrate until the shoe is actually here. Um, but, you know, once that gets here, you know how we do. The on feet, the review, the whole Actually, hopefully, again, hopefully Adidas don't break this this easy thing up, man. It's, it's easy, right? But anyway, I'll have it here. We'll do the review. I'm so excited because I like that colorway. That was one of the that was one of the first colorways I was looking at when I saw the list of Yeezys, at least remaining Yeezys that Adidas was going to sell. And then I get another notification. I was like, "What? What's going on?" Now keep in mind, this is like around three, four ish. Like oh, another notification. The Yeezy MX Phone Runner Senders. Listen, again, shocked because I figure I four years and four years of using the confirmed app, I've had one win. And that's it. One win. And so far, and 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 one day I've had two. Right? I'm thinking, all right, the day's up. I'm good. Let me go on about my business. And then a third email came in. The Yeezy Onyx Slide. Listen, I am stoked to have all three of these foam shoes come in, especially because the summer's coming up. And usually sometimes when the Yeezy Foam Runners and the slides would come out, they would come out in a time where you're like, man, the summer is like almost over. So what's the point of wearing this? I got to wait till next year to wear it. So I, I kind of like the way, or at least the timing of the release. I didn't like the fact that it was on a Wednesday. I just like the fact that it's, it's, it's shoes that you could potentially get during the summer and kind of wear it during the duration of that summer, if that makes sense. So, you know, your boy, I don't know. See, this is why I waited and I wasn't copying anything. I wasn't copying any Jordans, none of that stuff, because I knew a day like today, and it's not even over yet, um, where you have a chance to cop a lot of Yeezys. It was just a matter of picking and choosing. And I kept looking at the Jordan releases like, oh, okay, 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 okay. And, and let's be honest, some people were just, and they're picking and choosing. It's not like we're saying that Jordan is crap or anything like that. It's just that when I saw Yeezy Day, which is, and I'm calling it Yeezy Day, it was a priority. It was automatic priority. This way I knew what I wanted to get from this lineup. And so far, I think I got three. We'll see when that hopefully gets here again. I'll review all three of them all at once. Um, but then I want to see also if I can get the Pirate Blacks. Now, I highly doubt I'll be able to get this Yeezy 3 V1, but hopefully I'll be have that on the Milton Nipson channel. I'll kind of go through that because I'm curious. Please comment below and shout out to my man, Gunnar Tierno, for coming on the live. Um, that man is so informative and, and, and so helpful to others. Um, you know, he, he puts a lot of work in uh, at least having a channel up live, giving people some, you know, some ideas, at least little nuggets uh, so you can help, you know, at least to help people to cop manually. And, you know, shout out to Gunner, man. You know, hopefully you, can, you continue to do your things, all I'm going to say. Um, you've been a, a, an inspiration to me, at least uh, on my channel. And I, I don't know if I could have done anything, actually any of these W's without you, so I appreciate you, bro. But your boy, Milton Vincent, man, I am out. Again, comment below. Let me, let me know if you actually went for any of the Yeezys. If you did, which one did you cop? How did you feel about actually today's release? Do you feel like it was fair? I felt like there was a good amount of W's for manual users. So salute to everybody that has participated. But your boy, Mel never said. All right. So before I go, the Yeezy Adidas confirmed app crashed. And, and I'm pretty sure you guys experienced this where your account got logged out. But right before all that happened, I put in for the Yeezy Foam Runner, the Clay Red, and I just got this notification. I don't know what's going on, but 
man, it went from like confirmed app was the death of me for four years to confirmed app, I love you. Okay, now I'm out. You guys, stay blessed.